This is part of our trying to reduce battery drainage, so get a longer, shall we say, daily amount that we can use on our laptops, desktops, etc, etc, the ones that are using batteries and tablets. Okay, now you'll generally find the little power icon over here, and you can click on that and come to the screen. We're using a desktop over here, and we're just going to show you how to find it if it's not there. So power and sleep settings, additional power settings, it's in control panel, basically. And here we are. Change plan settings, change advanced power settings. Now, in the sleep section, allow wake timers. Okay. There may be certain hardware devices on your computer that suddenly, like for example the network adapter, etc., that suddenly wake up your computer and then your computer starts losing its battery charge, okay? Power is being drained from the computer. We might want to stop that, okay? Now, if by chance you do not have in your power options in sleep, the wake timer is one, there is a file that you'll find in the description on the YouTube video. All it does is basically in the registry, it goes to this location, okay, and it sets the attribute to 2. Now I can go to the registry, we can, it's all Windows based, nothing extra. Reg, R E G E D I T, okay, and if I run it, and it'll start up over there. Now, as you can see, it is quite complicated. You know, you need to go and find the exact position where it is, go all the way down. We have done that ourselves, okay, and you can see the attribute over there, okay. If this is changed to 2, you will then get this within your power options. So, I'm just going to shut that down, and I'm just going to Double-click on our registry file. Okay, you've already seen it. There's nothing much in it except for just changing a setting that you can always change back if you want to. Okay, now, just to flip in and out so that the settings are updated, allow wake timers. Now, if I disable this, any device that likes to wake up my computer Okay, on its own, for whatever reason the device might have, for example, a keyboard, a network adapter, or anything else, it's now disabled. They're not going to be able to wake up the computer from our sleep setting. So our battery is going to last longer whilst it's in sleep. If you need to put it back to the original way, all you need to do is just edit that little file, change him back to 1, Click save, close him down, you don't have to run him. Click yes, yes, okay. I'll just flip in and out so that the settings are updated and you'll see it's gone. Okay, so hopefully this helps and if it does, give us a like and thank you for watching. Thank you.